there's something I want to talk to you about. So, obviously, with your situation going in and out of prison, it's just becoming a bit too much for me, you know, with a kid and everything. I can't be doing everything by myself. Is it hard to do this thing? I'm doing this for us, though. Yeah, I know, but it's not working. I can't be alone. That's the reason I'm changing. Two, 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 I'm changing people. for you. I'm changing for me. But you said all that before, I'm and I'm changing. tired. I know, but this is different now. We have a child, and I'm doing it for him as well. I've got a probation officer, he's just got me an interview. And once I start making money, we're all going to be fine again. This is the last time, the last chance I'm going to give you, okay? Because if not, I'm out of here. Been released, he's coming fresh out the can. He wants to change his life. Well, that's part of the plan. He beats a probation officer who hooks him with an interview. Who's held people up in the past that was on Joseph's route. He tells Joseph to just be on time and show that you're passionate and you will be fine. He got Joseph an interview now for a hotel job as he knew the employee as he took people with records on. Come and I'll confide to you about Joseph's past. He got caught trapping to an undercover fed inside the car. He ended up doing a little bit more time as during the visits. Now he tried to smuggle a fault inside. Deep down, you can tell he was pissed. He would be, he missed the birth of his kid. Deep inside, he had furious hunger. All he wants to do really is just become a good father figure. He felt bad for the fact he left his missus all alone. He feels he should look after the kid with her now at home, his missus Sherry said. Now, if he slipped, that's it. She's got to end their relationship and now dip quick. She was faithful to Joseph while he was stuck inside doing time. One of the main reasons Joseph thought she was right or die. A lot of guys approached her, but instead she curved them. Let me tell you something. She was faithful, that was for certain. Joseph was known as the money man in the ends. For Sherry and his kid, he wants to make amends. Since being fresh home, he's someone brand new. Now Joseph's focus ready for his interview He's taking his probation officer's advice When he took all the notes He's going through notes about the hotel values Now you know he finished prepping So he has an early night He's confident about tomorrow deep down in his There mind. was nothing going on for Joseph Before he did time in prison He was a local lad who had no future or ambition Until he did time and now the real chance to reflect He doesn't want to put his family down through bullshit again There was nothing going on for Joseph Before he did time Time in prison, he was a local lad who had no future or ambition until he did time and had the real chance to reflect. He doesn't wanna put his family now through bullshit again. Joseph woke up for his interview and about seven in the morning. He was struggling to wake up as he woke up, he was yawning. He woke up early, actually, to my surprise, because all he wants is to make it to his interview on time. His missus was kissing him, wishing him good luck today. To the place of the interview is where Joseph makes his way. Everything was completely fine until Joseph hopped on the train. There was announcements made, there has been a major delay. Ladies and gentlemen, just to inform you, we have a trespasser on the track. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. In the meantime, the train's being held whilst I get the all clearance from the line controller. Thank you. We'll keep you updated. Due to the trespassers on the tracks, the train never moved It looks as if Joseph's gonna be late to his interview Once the delays are finished, the train makes it to Joseph's station He got destined by minutes to make it to his destination He was real pissed due to the fact he was already running late He now came across a person walking at a slow pace Joseph barged through him, Rudy, but I think it is saying sorry The guy that Joseph barged demanded an apology This resulted in them two now having an altercation Joseph was using language that was deemed as threatening Joseph told the guy to go suck his mum and kept it moving while the other guy shook his head shocked in total disappointment Joseph manages to get to his interview one time he was introduced by an employee wearing a suit and tie the employee says the manager is currently running late and where he arrives the interview will commence okay the manager came and Joseph can't believe what he saw his department 
person Joseph had an encounter with before He didn't even let the interview start He told Joseph his attitude won't get him far The way you spoke to me was unacceptable So therefore I'ma terminate this interview I won't let you speak like that to customers over here Joseph was begging and pleading He was just close to shedding tears The manager told Joseph we are done over here There was nothing going on for Joseph Before he did time in prison He was a local lad who had no future or ambition Until he did time and now the real chance to reflect He doesn't wanna put his family down through bullshit again There was nothing going on for Joseph Before he did time in prison He was a local lad who had no future or ambition Until he did time and now the real chance to reflect He doesn't wanna put his family down through bullshit again